This that I have in my hand is an iPad. So the fact is, it's so much more than that. Think of it as the iPad Remap, an all-in-one educational tool of the future. Our, our product, the Papyrus, trans, uh, transforms education and slingshots it into the 21st century. We, Classroom Synergies, um, partner with Apple to create a collaborative, connective, um, and ed uh, educational experience. Now I'd like to introduce you to our COO, Andrew. Our vision of the Pyre software is to provide the upcoming generation with an effective 21st century education. Our mission is to implement a technologically advanced tool to facilitate and foster an educational network. We want to enable the classroom to be a more interactive environment between the student and teacher. For our structure, under our operations, we have our CEO, our COO, and our CFO. Beneath our services, we have our tech director our pro and our project director. And finally, underneath our marketing, we have our business development and our public relations. Now let me introduce Shivani, who is our four person for marketing. Hi, my name is Shivani and I'm the head of public relations. Um, just a quick uh, set of hands. How many of you, like me, feel back pain having to carry around so many textbooks every day? As you can see, judges, that's a lot of hands. But, well, not all of you are alone, because according to, uh, according to uh, an estimates from the Consumer Product Safety Commission, there are nearly 7,500 emergency room visits each year due to injuries related to backpacks and book bags. Fortunately, we have solutions to these problems. Our software requires that every, kids um, have to turn in their assignments through an electronic portal to their teachers, so they don't have to worry about papers flying around in the backpacks or keeping binders with them. Secondly, let's talk about the textbooks. They're a pain, right? But hey, you don't have to worry about them now because they're all on or online uh, library on the iPod on the iPad itself. So, how are we going to advertise this? We don't need billboards. We don't need magazines. We're going to go straight to the private schools themselves. And we're going to talk to the administration and state our case like, about the impact of our product on their educational facilities. We shall truly advocate the fact that the Papyrus is the first software out there that encompasses the entire learning experiences of high school and college students within a single device. Now please let me introduce Connie, our Director of Marketing. Good afternoon, my name is Connie. Not only does the Papyrus software aid users in school on school grounds, but it also facilitates other businesses to a larger scale. For example, textbooks, um, they could, textbook industries could uh, decrease pretty large in textbooks like we tell that utility, oh my god, uh, that recently will be saving money on resources. Also, Apple will bolster its reputation in the educational market by using our technologically advanced product in the field of learning. Finally, users would significantly save trees by completely terminating the use of papers by being efficient. <coughs> the virus is truly a project of the future. All in all, we are journeying to, the, to conserve energy and pr produce less carbon emission while making other companies look good in a push toward environmental remediation. My name is Jaime, our tech director. Hi, my name is Jaime, and I'm the director of technology here at Papyrus. And uh, in order to secure success and, fu and the future of the generation, we must adopt, we must adapt to the technology because we need to engage the students of today. Now, our software, we believe, is innovative enough to create a revolutionary idea that will incite all these students to just pay more attention in class. Now, what we have established here in uh, Synergy is uh, an educational network that not only links the student body to the administration, <coughs> but we facilitate the communication to this improportionate ratio of students to, admi to administrators. Now, we have a lot of applications which are small-scale programs that appease consumers. Now, we have an online library that not only facilitates the purchases of textbooks, books, but we also have the textbooks, the actual documents on your iPad through this network of the online library. Now, when you get to college, you're gonna have these two hour monotonous, I mean, the most boring lectures from your professors. Now, through the papyrus system, 
whatever that professor says, we have a voice recognition program that will annotate every single word that professor says. On your papyrus, you have everything outlined from what he said, so you don't have to be taking notes. Now, we have a digital locker system that will reduce the sedentary life of all college students, but because we have an online profile thing that all students, their academic information is demonstrated on their profile. So students with similar disabilities, similar uh, interests can start study groups through this digital locker where all these profiles are database and so everyone who's on the papyrus system can look at this profile and say, hey, this student is exactly like me. I want to collaborate with this student. So the papyrus advocates a collaborative learning environment so that the sedentary life of a college student does not have to be enforced. Now I'm going to direct this to the HR rep, Chaplin. Bonjour, je m'appelle Jacqueline. That's what the iPad taught me. Just kidding. Um, <laughs> the greatest assets a company can be, as quoted from Rotary, is the people. Our three divisions for working would be marketing, sales, and engineering. As for recruiting people, we're going to recruit them right out of college, college fairs. We'll have the jobs, applications online, and we will find these people. Uh, our goal, we're looking for people who are relaxed, yet passionate and serious about their work, and we want them to have great work ethics. They, we want people to make an impact on the world, and we'll provide all the resources available for them. Compensation and benefits are varies from stock options and, of course, full health care, because that's what everyone needs, right? Um, we'll also have flexible time, monthly evaluations with your mentor, and there's always room for promotion and moving up the corporate ladder. I would like to now introduce you, Max, our project director. Thank you. Uh, well, one of the most unique parts of Papyrus is the fact that it's operated exclusively on the iPad, and this is in fact an, uh, an essential part of our business model, because we understand that Apple is the uh, foremost leader in um, tablet technology, a leader in the uh, tablet market, and so this is an essential part of our business plan. Um, we also divided our business strategy into three uh, general uh, phases of operation. So in our first, uh, our first phase, which we have already accomplished, is to implement Papyrus in five private universities throughout the United States, and we've been able to do this with educational grants from both the federal and state governments, uh, as well as from corporate financing directly from Apple. Um, we would like you, uh, through your support, we would be able to accomplish our uh, second general phase, which would be the expansion of Papyrus to 25 private universities throughout the United States, and uh, to, uh, it would also allow us to significantly uh, strengthen our distribution network. And then finally, through your support, we'll be able to reach our third phase of operations, which would entail us uh, operating strictly on internal revenue generated through our business, and it would allow us to reach approximately 25% of the educational tablet market by the year 2020. So now I'd like to introduce our CFO, Sebastian. Thanks, Max. So, our company's financial plan will include the three-phase strategy to launch our products, garnering a substantial amount of money made over this three-year period, as it's laid on this graph. In phase one, we sold 1,000 units to five universities at the price of $200 per unit, which accumulated $1 million in gross revenue, and then that yielded a modest net income after taxes of $60,450. So in order to launch into phase two, we're seeking a capital of $1.2 million. We plan on expanding to 25 universities, selling 5,000 units each at $400 per unit, which will generate a gross revenue of $50 million, which will yield $30,670,000 in net income after taxes. For our final phase, we plan on expanding to 654 universities that sell 3.3 .3 million units at the price of $400 per unit, which will amass $1.2 billion in, gr in gross revenue and yield over $700 million in net income after taxes. So, as you can see, this is a great financial plan, and all we need from you is $1.2 million to make this happen. And now I'll direct the mic to our CEO, Kyle. As you can see, we have a great product. We have the market needed to sustain this product. We also have the people. We also have the dream. Now, all we need is you. Thank you for your time.